Wiggy time on the fly. What's up, everybody? Sean Wiggins here uh, with myself. Hey, there I am. January 31st, 2004. And I try not to put uh, matches from shows on my channel so close, but this one gets an exception. There's goofiest goof of all time, Pat Savino. Biggest loser I've ever met in wrestling. Um, just a total ass wipe. But the guy coming to the ring right now is anything but... And uh, that is my late friend. And here he comes. Where the hell is he? I don't know who I'm talking to up there. Who the hell am I? See, the boys were standing around up there up at the top. I'm talking to somebody. There he is. No gimmicks needed himself, man. The late Chris Candido. Uh, I don't miss anybody more than him. <laughs> Throw a chair in there. Uh, I am going to try to get the audio on here. Uh, Candido loved me. And uh, I loved him, man. He was just everything. <laughs> he, really, he was so funny, man. He would do stuff like that, not call it. He was just uh, as close to a natural as you could get in, in pro wrestling. And in the 90s, a guy his size, and there's Tammy. I, I would always oversell for it. I didn't need to go back that far. But uh, Tammy and Chris were in a good mood that night. I, leg I think Chris is wrestling Damian Adams here, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but yeah, the Mark promoter uh, of this Fed, SSCW, what's that Fed you came to see, uh, said he was going to try to get this event on pay-per-view. And uh, yeah, Candy would always do that. I was like, hey, you don't have any foreign objects in there. And he'd go, yep, 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 right here. It is Damian Adams. Okay, Damian Adams, my good buddy. Damien Adams. That's a shoot, too. Uh, I love Damien Adams. Good dude. Damien, if you're out there, hope you get to see this. If you don't have this match and you never saw it, I hope you uh, are tuning in. Because this was a fun night. Uh, this was a Saturday night in Clifton, New Jersey. As you can see, just not a lot of people there. But we made the most of it. Um, Candido and Tammy uh supposed to be the heels. But since all the boys are up at the top watching this one, they are the baby faces. And wait a minute, here we go. Let's try to pick this up. Guys, I know everybody's been taking a lot of time on the mic tonight. I'm sure everybody, including myself and Chris and even got a little want to get home. Yeah! 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 He was definitely just trying to pop the boys. Uh, so this one may not go too long. Candido, fast start here on Damian Adams. Damian Adams is kind of brand new here. Not brand new. He probably was in wrestling for a couple years by this point. But uh, he's still out there. And if you're young and you're trying to get... Ooh, if you're young and you're trying to get into the industry or you're brand new and you want someone who can teach you, find Damian Adams because uh guy's got a brain in his head. He and I agree a lot. Uh, on pro wrestling. I haven't seen him in a few years and that's on me because I just kind of left wrestling. But he knows I love him. Uh, Candido actually died maybe a little over a year and a half after this and God, we miss you every day, Chris. We just, he was, he was entertaining the boys as much as he was entertaining the fans but the fans didn't know he was entertaining the boys. I could go all night on Candido but this one's not going to last that long. Um, this was the main event that night. As you heard him. Um, this guy, he punched good. He sold good. He took the turnbuckle good. He did everything good. He <laughs> didn't poke in the eye there. Um, you can see him acting like a goof myself in this match. Because I'm just having so much fun. I mean, maybe it doesn't come across here on camera. But, God, I was having so much fun in there. We hugged when we saw each other. 
he told the promoter of this show, the guy was booking it, Sean McCaffrey, that he wanted me to ref his match. And that always makes you feel good. Two, and I'm not, you know, being a goof there. He actually did. And sometimes some refs are, you know, requested. And I always was glad to be requested. And there's so many times I could have refed for him and didn't. Tammy now, oh, see, come on. Tammy, it's, I should have known better that Tammy Sitch would try to cheat. I'm not paying attention. Chris now, house of fire. The proverbial house of fire. I'm acting like I didn't see nothing. But Chris probably did a good job of distracting me. And if you are out there and you have a valet or a manager who's going to interfere, for the love of God, try to distract the ref. Superplex. I mean, Candido, he just it looked flawless. You know, Candido, he's got a t-shirt on here, but probably didn't need it. He was a little puffy. But it was after this when he'd get in shape, he'd get clean, get in amazing shape, and then a goddamn blood clot took him from us. So, I mean, it's just we were, we were robbed of Candido. He'd still be going today. Ooh, nice super kick. Is that going to be enough to do it? Shawn Michaels ask. It is. So that gets the best of Chris Candido. Damian Adams going to get the win here and retain the SSCW Heavyweight Championship. I don't know how soon this cuts off, so Riva Dirty and Chow. Uh, I'm going to be signing off here. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Please drive safe, but will we get any post-match antics out of Candido? I'm not sure. But, uh... Candido, one of the only guys I've ever ref for where everything was flawless. Like, uh, something you can't you can't teach. So Damien got the super kick. Well, that was a five, six minute match right there. Damien Adams retained his SSCW championship. And uh, he would go on. And, well, that's it. So for Sean Wiggins, I'm Rep Hanson. I hope you enjoyed that quick Chris Candido match. Chris, we love you. We miss you. Arrivederci and ciao.